in Christ Alone, page two. I'm pretty sure we're going to start this page on an up bow because we were going down at the end of the last page. Now, down in measure 57, um, on beats two and three, it goes up to fifth position, and I don't think you want to do that. So when you get to measure 57, play the downbeat of measure 57, rest, and then a down bow on measure 58. So you would probably want to mark in a circle bow so that you can come out down bow. That's what we'll be doing. So when I do this right now, I'll just play what I told you, but on Sunday, I'll play what's printed. So you'll just have to know that you're going to do it a little differently from me there. Okay, so we're up bow. Notice in measure 38, the second measure of this page, there's an A natural and then an A flat. So you'll play, an, you can play an open A for the A natural and then for the A flat, you have to go to your low four on the D string. Oh, one more thing I noticed down in measure 52, there is a D flat. Now D flat is actually pretty much in the same place as C sharp. So you'll actually be playing like a high two. You might notice there's a two written above that. Then there's a three written over the first note in measure 53. That is the suggested shift to second position, but you don't need to worry about that. Just do it in first position. So just play a low four on the A flat. Just, you can cross out those numbers, um, those fingerings in measure 53. Um, there's another D flat in measure 60. And this time it would actually make more sense to play it with a low three because you're playing an E flat right in front of it, and then you play a C natural right after it. So actually, um, the finger pattern, I'm gonna start in measure 61, and I'm gonna play the notes in measures 61 and 60 in backwards order so you can see what the finger pattern is going to be. So measure 61 ends with an A flat, which is a low four on the D string. And the next is a B flat, low one. C natural is low two, but it's a whole step away from a low one. And then here's that D flat. It's a low three. It goes right next to the two. And then the E flat is a low four. So coming down, it's E flat, E flat, C, E, A flat. Okay. I think I'm ready to do the whole piece now. So, or all of page two. One, two, three. to measure 51. It occurred to me when I was playing that, that part's a little tricky. It just goes a little fast. So 
I'm going to do it under tempo with separate bows just so you can hear all the notes a little better. Here we go. G, low one, low one, low four, open, low two, now actually a high two, low four, low one, low four, low two, this is to practice it with hooked staccato still under tempo to help you get the bowings so it would be like this ready go dum, dum. There you go. 